think that's actually Why is possible. Why is it illogical? Because it's pitting all species at one time on a No, boat. not all species are getting it wrong, it's kind. Okay, fine, but even kinds, the earth is so huge, how do you get one of every animal? You bring it to a God problem, that's what the Bible says. God created this thing to bring them into the world. For your unity or survival or something like that. You know? Where are these miracles now? We haven't seen God do anything that extravagant in a long time. Why does he have to? To prove himself possibly, like he did then? That's why he's done it back then, why does he do it again? Because he's so broken it back then, besides Let me tell you how God's proven himself, sir. Tell you how God's proven himself. Do you, do you believe in morality? Do you only went over there? Yes, I do. Okay? You believe John abuse is wrong, right? Yes, I do. Come on, I'll say your skin. Do you believe that rape is wrong? Unjust murder is wrong? Yes. What reason, what reason do you believe those things are wrong? Because they cause human suffering. Okay, why is suffering wrong? Okay, so if someone wants to rape, it's it's suffering, if someone wants to rape with suffering, because you can't rape anymore, is that a bad experience, friend? Does that mean it's wrong to cause them to stop raping people? You're skirting on more relatives than that. Personally, I would say absolutely correct. Okay, so what reason do you have to say that? Everyone is just in doing what they find is just. Okay, so if someone stole from you today, they'd be just in doing that. If someone stole from you today, they'd be just in doing that. If they felt like they were just, they'd be right. So it comes from feelings then. What's that? So feelings are the foundation of morality. I'm not saying that necessarily. It's human suffering. Human suffering. I'm, I'm not moral absolutist just like you are. So this is kind of a. Uh, really? So what I'm trying to prove to you here. What was your name again? I'm oh, sorry, Sean. Yeah. Sean Kerrigan. I remember you were back uh, a year or so ago. Anyway, Sean, um, your foundation of morality is crumbled. Because because you're problem, saying it's, it's always changing based on what I see, what I feel. What you, you know, feel? the current state of things. Like for instance, you know, murder back in you know, the Old Testament was, was okay, but now not so much. You know, that's the way society no, works. No, murder was adapts. never okay. Yeah. Murder was never okay. Well, well, read the Old Testament. How many times does it say kill your neighbor? Well, there's just kill your neighbor. Not literally, but. What? Sean, Sean, you're good. I don't think you're doing wrong again. Sorry, you're getting wrong here, Sean. Well, what's the wrong one? It says you saw your daughter in the slavery. Well, let me, let me, let me explain that, Sean. If you're interested in the uh, Levitical law, you just got done saying that morals don't change. They don't, they don't change. The covenant of the Jewish law given to a nation called Israel. Okay? As a natural law. So the, the, the Jews can do something else? Like, like my friend over there is Jewish. Can he murder someone, but I can't? No, sir. It's a governmental law. Okay. It's justice, sir. And those in, in the Jewish religion, okay? A Jewish writer. If you, uh, if you do those okay. things. He can sell his daughter in slavery, but I can't? You're not listening, sir. That's not the point. You're not listening. Oh, sorry. That's okay. I'm oh, sorry. I can give you a All right, you're not sorry. Okay, so for the covenant of the law, the Jewish law says that these laws were given to the Jews, not to us Americans. We have laws here in America. We say that the laws here in America, in certain states, you commit a crime, you get them. In certain states, you don't. Over in uh, other countries, they have different laws for their land. Those were the laws for the land of Israel. It wasn't an individual killing another individual. It was exercising justice as a government, as a country. Okay? And the reason why we only use it ourselves is we're Christians, we're but Gentiles, we're not Jews, we're Gentiles. We don't live in a theocracy anymore, which is what the Jews lived in. So it's changed. Well, the morals, the morals the have the not law, changed, sir. Your morality is still thou shalt not murder. That was justice. If you put someone on an electric no, 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 chair... You're just going to say that the, the, the Jewish old law isn't applying anymore. You're not listening, sir. You're not listening. So when anyone can have the other. Fair, fair enough, but the civil law is still not the same as it was back in the time of the Old Testament. Because they changed the civil law themselves. The Jewish, the Jewish nation, Israel, was a theocracy run by God. And they made one a king over themselves. They became an anarchy or dictatorship, whatever you want to call it. But the king always received from God. We don't have that today. There's no other nation that ever has been or ever will be that will be a theocracy. So therefore, we don't have the laws that God would give us as a nation. We have the laws we come up with. But individuals never have been able to murder and it'd be okay. But should, but should God's laws be better than our ones that we make? Sure. Up? So why don't you go to Washington, D.C. and tell them to have a theocracy? Well, is that what you want, though? No, like, if God's laws are infallible, they shouldn't be. Because God didn't choose America as a nation, sir. He chose Israel as a nation. He chose America as a nation. Yeah, God himself chose. The point is, if Jesus, if God said that these are my laws, should we uphold those laws? It doesn't make sense. Like, you're saying that we made up the... So go ahead, sir. I'll vote them. What's that? I'll vote them. Go ahead. I, I've told you over and over again, sir. We're not a Jewish nation. I really, I'm we not are a Gentile nation. Uh, Therefore, I so we don't have a theocracy. Therefore, we don't have a theocracy. That's not the point I'm making. The point I'm making is that God laid down His law for His people, His Jewish people, 
Are you his people? What's that? Are you his people? No, I'm an Ain't all parties.